Former President of Nigeria, Goodluck Jonathan, on the 28th of May 2011, signed the Freedom of Information Bill into law. The aim to enthrone accountability in Nigeria's public institutions by building on the assumptions of openness and unfettered access to information by the public. Ten years later, the Bureau of Public Service Reforms is introducing an evaluation policy on the performance of the Act. The Bureau of Public Service Reforms fully supports the Freedom of Information Act, but after more than a decade in operation, or almost a decade, it is time to review the process to make sure it is working effectively. It is in this respect that between October and December 2018, we, in collaboration with our partners, Mark Otto Foundation and R2K, undertook a study in consonance with the mandate of the Bureau of Public Service Reforms. Director General of the agency, Ibrahim Arabi, further highlighted some measures that could strengthen the implementation of the Freedom of Information Act. It is interesting to note, for example, from the study that in 2018, only 8.1% of Nigerians, approximately 900 public institution complied with Section 29 of FOI Act. Similarly, as of July 2018, a leading civil society organization, the International Center for Investigative Reporting, had filed a series of FOI requests to various public institutions, with 90% of the requests yet to be responded to. Some of the identified evidence-based policy recommendations to strengthen the implementation of the Act includes better policy making, focusing on better targeted instruments, among others. Sagir Ibrahim, CNN News.